morning, my dear friend. It is Monday, January 17th, and our reading for today takes us through the end of the book of Job, chapters 40 and 42, and greetings from Fairhaven, Michigan. And we're still looking at that same verse, that same little phrase, blessed are the poor in spirit, for theirs is the kingdom of heaven, Matthew 5, verses 3 and 4, verse 4. Blessed are those who mourn, for they shall be comforted. Yesterday, we talked about the importance of what we mourn about. And we see Jesus mourning or weeping over the city of Jerusalem. It says this in Matthew 23, 37 through 39. O Jerusalem, Jerusalem, the city that kills the prophets and stones those who are sent to it. How often would I have gathered your children together as a hen gathers her brood under her wings, and you were not willing. See, your house is left to you desolate, for I tell you, you will not see me again until you say, Blessed is he who comes in the name of the Lord. The Lord does have a time for us to mourn, a time to be concerned, to, to even weep before him because of sin, because of difficulty. And we want to have that type of mourning in our lives because we will see later those who, are, those who mourn are comforted. Let's pray. Heavenly Father, we come to you. Lord, when you're concerned, distressed about sin, about hard hearts, we want to have that same distress in our hearts. Lord, that we can be comforted only by you in your moving grace. In Jesus' name, amen.